Anything else? No, I feel great. Thank you. Okay, I'm glad. I don't believe you, but I. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, Fred, let's work just the slate right now. You all know what a slate is. You introduce your name and the pieces you'll be doing. And uh, there's a real art to it, as far as, or at least a lot of skill, uh, technique, craft. The acting is, you let them know you're approachable. You have boom, audience-pleasing quality because you're pleasing the casting directors. You're, you're nice, you're likable, and uh, hopefully you're exciting. Now, in, in the monologue, you can be exciting and show them that you can be exciting, but um, nice, you keep in mind it's the personality, your personality that comes through here. This is one shot, maybe your two monologues are going to be ugly and uglier, you know, so uh, charming, pleasant, uh, all of the good stuff. And you say, you greet with hi or hello. I recommend hi because you can punch it up more, but it's up to you. Um, your name Sometimes people just say their name, Ted Sorantos, rather than, hi, I'm Ted Sorantos. Hi, my name is, they know that you're introducing yourself. So we're going to streamline it. Hi, Ted Sorantos, Hamlet, Othello. I'm doing Hamlet, I'm doing Othello. Uh, it's not, today I'm going to be doing for you two monologues, <laughs> and one of them is by William Shakespeare. <laughs> called Hamlet, and I'm going to be playing the part of Hamlet. That's just what I was going to do. <laughs> you stole, you you stole my line. <laughs> yeah, um, you want to blow them away with the words in the monologue. And so they want to get the basic information, and you're showing them your personality within that eight seconds that it takes you to say the handful of words. Tell us what words you're going to use. You don't have to okay, sleep right now. Here's what I intended on doing <laughs> until you hit me. Uh, hi, I'm Fred Schutz. I'll be doing Joe Keller from All My Sons by Arthur Miller and Big Daddy from All My uh, from A Cat on a Hot Tin Roof by Tennessee Williams. If you were doing obscure plays, maybe the playwright and the part and so on would be okay. But especially since people know these two pieces, uh, if they should yeah. if they're in theater, uh, I think you can streamline it. How would you want us? And, and you know what, Fred, if that's you feel, well, I don't want no. you to feel comfortable. Isn't that a surprise? When you're up here, you should be on edge. You should be hyper. You should be electricity. Um, enjoying it, but uh, butterflies in your stomach. So, um, well, it's the first part. Hi, Fred Schutz. Hey, that was good, right, folks? Yeah. Hi. Again. Hi, Fred Schutz. And again. Hi, Fred Schutz. Yeah, nice. And next. All right, see. I'll be doing Joe Keller. See, I don't know where to swim. Uh, Joe Keller. How about, uh, well, I don't All see. my sons, cat on a hot tin roof. Just bang. Like, yeah. yeah. See, uh, all my sons, cat on a hot tin roof. That's nine words right there. Now, normally, if you, they give you a minute and a half, 90 seconds, not 91 seconds, then they start the stopwatch when you say the first word of the first monologue. So it kind of doesn't make any difference on your time if you do too much in the slate, but it, uh, well, it's certainly unnecessary. Yeah. You know, yeah. But, uh, I, you know, I thought that was the Form. protocol, you know, to uh, let them know, well, the person, the, the character, they're going to, they got to know it's Big Daddy, although it, it should hopefully show itself to be that, but, uh, I, 
I don't know what to tell you on that. You know, when I've sat through like 80 auditions uh, in one day, in one sitting, um, it's almost impossible just getting the name of the play down that that person is doing, let alone the character is um, like you're taking notes all the time and well, missing half the action. So, but I, I, I would think that you wouldn't need uh, the playwright for All My Sons, everybody knows that, or Cat on a Hot Tin Roof, that's pretty yeah. obvious, although... And the character, if they'll catch on right away that you're Big Daddy, or um, they might um, not... Joe but, Keller. But they might Joe, not... Yeah. Now it should be just Joe, maybe, instead of Joe Keller. No, if you're going to say the name of the character, I'd say both names, Joe Keller. Joe Keller. That might help them. But uh, what I'm really saying is you may not need to say the name of the character. It, it's your choice. Yeah, folks. well, this is, I want to straighten it out because I don't want to think maybe I should and maybe I shouldn't. You're going to do it the way you want to do it. Uh, just tell us the words right now. All right. Hi, Fred Schultz. I'll be doing Joe Keller from All My Sons by Arthur Miller, and Big Daddy from Cat on a Hot Tin Roof by Tennessee Williams. You know, if you did not said the playwright's names on both those, I'd say that's fine. Okay. All right. Once more. Hi, Fred Schutz. I'll be doing Joe Keller from All My Sons and Big Daddy from A Cat on a Hot Tin Roof. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, that sounded, it felt better too. Mm -hmm. I didn't, yeah. Mm -hmm.